More and more people are asking the question, why go to space? Aren't there enough problems on Earth already? Let's play that hypothetical and turn off American space capabilities. No more NASA, Space Force, or SpaceX. Poof, there goes NOAA's National Weather Service and the National Reconnaissance Office. The list goes on and on. But these investments in our space capabilities translate into real life benefits in so many ways, most of which we take for granted. For example, satellites have a major impact on our everyday lives. On a flight for your much deserved vacation, you can thank past investments in space to help the navigation and control of thousands of transoceanic flights that take off and land around the globe daily. Or for the technology used by rideshare apps to get you safely home at the end of the night. And you can thank the people before us who could see that investing in space wasn't a waste of money. These investments make this and so much more possible. Let's get more concrete. The year is 1900 on the coast of Texas. With little to no warning, a hurricane engulfs the town of Galveston and leaves anywhere from 8,000 to 12,000 people dead. Fast forward 108 years. Another hurricane is barreling down on Galveston, but this time, only 37 people lose their lives. Why? Because modern forecasts are powered by NOAA's Geostationary Operational Environmental Satellite, GOES system. Yes, satellites give us comfort and ease, but they also save lives. We should go to space to counter authoritarian powers like Russia and China. You don't have to be Sun Tzu to understand that occupying the high ground is a tactical advantage. Space is the ultimate high ground. At present, U.S. national security relies on space for reconnaissance, positioning services, and early warning systems for ballistic missiles. In the future, our space-based technology will be able to not only track ballistic missiles, but to shoot them down before they reach U.S. soil. Our satellite systems will need to be more advanced and harder to target. The satellites will be more maneuverable, and instead of single satellites, we'll just have large constellations providing fail-safes to critical services. Satellites not only provide invaluable tactical support, their ability to transmit images, videos, and communication can also have a lasting global impact, like reporting live from across the world during major turning points in history. All this would increase our ability to prevent war, death, and destruction. Devoting resources to space allows us to protect and spread democracy and freedom around the world. We want to protect the planet and space for future generations to come. Our space investments provide us with valuable scientific resources. By advancing our scientific knowledge in areas like climate, Earth's creation, the universe and dark matter, the origins of life here, and potentially on other planets. One thing is clear, there is plenty of science left to be done in space. In 1985, scientists used satellite imagery to confirm the depletion of the ozone layer. Satellites showed a hole of more than 20 million square kilometers. The international community reacted quickly, committing to eliminate ozone-depleting substances. In 2019, the ozone hole was reduced to less than half that size, the smallest in two decades. What other world-changing discoveries might we make with space technology? Our greatest advancements have come when the stakes are high and lives are on the line. From World War II to the COVID crisis, when lives are at risk, we tend to find creative and innovative solutions. The same danger and opportunity are present with human space settlement. We can unlock untold findings and developments that would help propel us into the future in ways we can't yet comprehend. From crafting our stars into parables and heroes, to trying to understand the fundamental laws of the universe, we have always been fascinated with the cosmos. In part, it's probably because, like Carl Sagan said, we're made of star stuff, and exploring the final frontier really means learning more about the universe giving us a deeper connection to our past, present, and future in ways we can't possibly comprehend. It's time to take our place in the cosmos.